James Lunnis, we have Alta Adige Zuterol. This is Zant Magdaliner. I'll tell you more about this wine. Stay tuned. So here's what we have. Now this is uh, Zant Magdaliner. You're gonna see this term versus the actual grape name, which is Schiava. So here's the wine right here. Now this is a 2017 vintage, low alcohol wines. And I always think of Zant Magdalena or Schiava wines as something to pair with food. You can definitely do it on its own, but I think the optimization of this experience is to taste with food and simple foods. I'm gonna add things like pizza or bolognese or getting a, a burger are gonna go well with this. Uh, charcuterie, cheese is fantastic. So often in this part of Italy, which is used to be part of Austria, is uh, Zutero, uh, a Tyrolean uh, range of Italy, is uh, you, you'll see both German and Italian. So this is from Kellerai, Schreckwichel, or the other name, the Italian name, is Cantina Colorenzio. I'll give you more characterization on the nose and the palate as well. So you're gonna find on this wine here, I like to read copy that I find anytime on a bottle of wine. So this says, the sun buzz tells around Cantina Colorenzio, were formed in the Ice Age and give rise to fruity red and white wines with great finesse and character. So 12.5% ABV, so uh, superbly low in alcohol. And uh, so on the characteristic note here, 91 points out of 100 points, a gentle fruit character. In addition to the fruit characterization, you're getting that uh, really nice savory note as well. Nicely done. So let me tell you about the scent characterization on this wine. First of all, the color. Um, you probably can't tell on this recording here, but it's really pale, pale ruby colorization. So it's not necessarily a rosé color, but it's really pale, pale red uh, ruby colorization. It's absolutely beautiful. So uh, very light tannins on this, so it's easy drinking, but again, optimized with food. So in this, uh, you know, cherry, strawberry notes, a bit of hoisin and violets. And what I like about this too, is almost like a bread note to it. So it's really getting that uh, characterization, bread and dash mineral note. So those are terms that I use to talk about savory qualities to a wine. And this definitely has a plenitude of that. And next, the palate characterization. So on this uh, palate, a lot of mountain strawberry notes, mineral, mint, and tea notes. 91 points out of 100 points. And if you don't see a Zant Magdalena, ask your wine merchant to bring them in as well as your favorite restaurant. And um, I always believe it's so important to let your, your favorite wine store know, as well as your favorite restaurant. So the wine directors and sommeliers and the wine buyers want to really do the right thing and buy the wines you want to buy. So be sure to let them know what you're seeking. And thank you for your support. More questions and comments can be listed down below or on the social medias that I'm on, such as Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, and WordPress. The like button's down below as well. And right up here is the subscribe button. So please hit that button. Thank you for your support. Many more great wines to come in the end of uh, third quarter of 2018. So thank you for your support. Stay tuned for more. Sante.